Well, hello, gang, and welcome back to Kenshi. Pretty sure I... What are you guys doing? Chasing somebody? Yep. Chasing a poor, hungry bandit. Black. So, I think I wanted to do a little bit of building this time. I mean... Fuck, I need copper to finish that. I completely forgot about copper when I placed those, like, two videos ago or something. It's not terribly important, I guess, that I have copper. Let's see, iron there. That's right, I can prospect, so... Let's see. Well, you suck at it. So, plump... You're the only one that's actually got prospecting skill, right? So... I've got copper up here that I could run to, apparently, right there. Hang on. Hit that one more time. Multiple copper over here. I guess it's just that one. Okay, um... I need 15 more copper, so... I'm gonna send Plump. And we're gonna send Kyra. Go work on that. Both of you are fairly quick. You've got bag space to spare. They've got great laboring skills, so we'll be able to hammer that out. Fairly quick. I think I'm also going to make him sneak. Look at that. We just barely peek over the wall and there's beak things out here. Not as terrifying. Again, these ones aren't, aren't the largest ones we've seen. Bandit demands are moving to the outpost. Is that right? Is that really how it's going to be? I see people moving up there. Or I thought I did. Damn bushes, I'm seeing things. Okay, so... Where are the bandits coming from? Possibly, no. Possibly. Either way, I'm not too too terrified of them. I still do have tech hunters in the base. Uh, when they get closer to the gates, I'll shut them and get people fired up on the crossbows. For now, let's just watch and see how it goes. We've got dust bandits right there. You're the ones threatening me? Really? Okay, close that. So, now this is the part where I'm sad that I don't have... Like, a hot key I can press to send people straight to their designated crossbow. This does get kind of tedious. I'm not even sure if some of them will be able to make it. Okay, everybody go do that. Close the door. It's locked. Definitely not going to need Plump and Kyra over here. Oh yeah, shoot those guys. It's good target practice. You must not have heard that this place that I still haven't named does not negotiate with bandits. Oh, they've got crossbows too. See, the angle is just right so we can hit them no matter where they stand, but they've got a much more difficult time getting an angle on us. Took that fucking arm out, dropped that douchebag. So... Going to assume... Going to assume I dropped your leader somewhere in here too. Dust bandit, dust bandit. Dust Bandit boss. Here we go. Okay, um... Charlos. Go loot him. 
I'm curious what gear he's got. Where is Charlos? Bandit demands have failed. Charlos is all the way over here. I completely forgot that I sent you out here on this journey. Okay. Um, wow. I sent you to go sell all this stuff. That's right. I'm going to let them handle all the cleanup. I'll loot the boss body when we get back there. That's kind of funny. That's what happens when I take breaks, though. Uh, what do you have to trade? I need all of these. Obviously. Sell that. Made a decent amount of cash from that. Buy all the books. We've got spring steel. I'll buy the copper, because why not? Your blueprints still suck. Allow us to build something bigger that can stand up to assaults from anything and everything. I would like to have that at some point. Advanced harpoonery. I can't grow cactus where I'm at. Might as well grab this stuff. And that's probably good. Okay, Charlos. Sorry about forgetting you there. I'm distracted with a million and one things. At the very least, you didn't die, so... Everybody, stand down. And... Now I need somebody with a fairly empty pack. It's my biggest problem right now. The miss. Go loot the boss. Surely he had something valuable, right? A hunting saber. I'll give you... Give you those. I'm gonna take all of this. Some decent boots. It's a shame you don't have a... A bounty on your head. I guess the cats are worth taking. There we go. They barely ever have anything better than shoddy grid. Shoddy, 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 shoddy. Basically shoddy. No, Mew Pew. What the hell happened to you? Azumi. You got beat up too. Damn, Mew Pew, Mew Pew took a blow to the stomach, to the chest. You went out there to fight. Built up some toughness getting your ass kicked. All in all, congratulations. Uh, however, get back over here, Revy. Or don't. I need somebody, damn it. Aurelius. You like to haul things around. These guys will have some bolts that I'll loot. Uh, I hate I hate dealing with bolts, but at some point I really am going to have to actually train some archers. I... Need range support, especially when we go hunting, if we ever go hunting things like leviathans. Uh, being able to shoot things with a crossbow and then just run away and kite it, pretty damn useful. Uh, you can't really wear any of that, so... Back about your business. Actually, pick up Mew Pew. Haul them around for a little bit, at least that way they'll be safe. Uh, Charlos, you can come inside the base... That is a nasty, long trail of blood. Everybody getting their medical on. Getting jammed up on the pathing. You fucking dinosaurs are so big. I really have to figure out the waypoint system so that I can... get them actually patrolling around. Uh, Denver, I want you to follow... Don't follow Dino anymore. Follow Slaxer. We'll get you broken up a little bit. 
Don't you glitch out on me. Okay, um, that's right. I was wanting to build some stuff before all that happened. See, you get so easily distracted. Searchlights, a powerful searchlight for external use only. Place them right there. Can't place them up there, but place them right there. We'll have lights everywhere. Power consumption is a whopping eight. Damn. Okay, I don't want to get too crazy with that. Spotlights. Power consumption of four. And those take electrical components too. So what's the difference? I wonder. A searchlight actively targets things that are moving maybe. Which is what I would actually want to use. Um, put some lights on front of the buildings. I'm not going to decorate that one because that one that building's going away soon. If I have anything to do with it. I could also put spotlights on the inside of my base here. I think for now I'll just pass. Shame I can't put one on the front. Of these walls. What if I... Place it right there. And see, I don't know what angle they cast at. It looks like they're pretty shallow. So it's not going to cast a long light source through here, but whatever. I think that'll be good for now. Charlos shows up being chased by bone dogs, it looks like, who found an easier mark. As well as starving bandits. Yep. It's a hungry bandit leader. He's not going to give up. He can't give up. If he gives up and looks weak in front of his men, that's it. They'll eat him alive. So, drop all those off. Does anybody else have any books? While I'm thinking about it. Yes. Slacks. You can come drop these off. Hey, he made a pair of sunglasses that are shoddy now. So, Slacks is getting better. You can go back to work. God, I need... Charlos? Oh, somebody in town's probably attacking you. I have got to build more storage for for a lot of stuff. I need to do... I really do need to do inventory. It's starting to finally get to me a little bit. I've got so much shit just randomly scattered around. I need medical crate storage to sort that out. Various weapon storages. Zan, you don't even have a weapon. That seems kind of unfortunate. Go loot. The boss probably has the best one, right? Okay, somebody was hungry. He's wearing the Nomad Black Cape. I like how it doesn't have an icon. Really, that goes on his armor? He's got one on his belt, too. So you probably only need one. I'm going to sell these two. That's weird that they don't show up. That they're just a... A blank square, but whatever. Horse chopper, you can wear that. I think everything else... Everything else can just be left. Sure. So, get your ass back in here. Where the hell are people being attacked at? Okay. Zan, really, they'll be fine. I need to get, well... It's like, do I want the capes or do I want the lights? Because it is a bit of a trade-off, apparently. The capes have protection for travelers. Extra 30% 30 30 protection on dust storms, acid, and rain. Put that up there. And you can get back to work, or go attack, do whatever you want. Pretty damn skilled bandit leader right there. Had 26 cats. Um, a 
nasty old horse chopper. Ultimately, just a minor distraction. Let's see... Is there anything else left for me to research now? Other than training stuff. We'll throw medicine and splints on there. Get plump to work. Throw all of the training on there. Used artifacts. Used artifacts. So... Maybe next video, I might take a little squad out, hire some mercenaries to protect me, take a squad out, see if we can go explore any of the ruins around here. Like, we'll backtrack through, maybe go all the way through Squin. I know somewhere over here... Yeah, something up... Th that's a long ways away through Holy Nation territory. Empty ruins. Damn, all the way down there. That is a long way to travel. Say, maybe we'll go check out the destroyed house first. Bounce off the ominous ruins here. I doubt. I doubt that either of those places have what I'm looking for. Searchlights complete. You know, I have to have more than enough copper by now, right? 13 on top of the two that I think Charlos is carrying. So, plump. Go ahead and take that. In fact, both of you just stop sneaking Kyra. You can leave too. That's enough for now. I just want enough to finish this. I don't really need to... What the hell is this? Is this a shopping one? Yep. Let's go shopping! Wait, come back you guys. I have more than enough goods. I have more than enough goods for you, I swear. Cha-ching. They buy a whole bunch of shitty sunglasses, I hope. Yup. It's a beautiful thing, isn't it? I made like six whole dollars there from the great rich men. Now look at that. Got searchlights on the gate. We almost look competent. However, look at that power draw. 130. 147, once more machinery starts getting used. The outside lights, yeah, they're not as bright as I thought they would be, but still not bad. I might place a few more behind these machines to light them up. Uh, I don't really know what I want to do here. I still want to kind of delete all of this. move my farms in that corner. I did a bit of looking uh, after I paused the last video, by the way, and I don't think I'm ever going to be able to grow anything here except what I'm already growing. Uh, vegetables only have an 8% yield. Cotton has an 8% yield. Even hemp, I guess that has a 46% yield. We could do hemp. Rice has a 0% yield. 8% on their vegetables as well. And then, of course, the wheat that we're already growing. So this is pretty much what we're stuck with. Uh, I may move my farming back here. I'm pretty sure I've already mentioned that. If I don't get it up here, which I probably won't. Because, quite frankly, I don't know where else I would get raw stone from. Unless I really do expand my whole base out and around. Just wrap the wall. All the way fucking through there. Is there any other city in the game that's even that big? 
Like, I doubt that I've seen the biggest NPC cities yet, but it's possible. I figured, based on its name, that the hub would be big, but that was... Nothing but a pile of ruins. Fairly small, too. So, Mew Pew, how are you doing? You're still in a recovery coma. That's fine. What the hell's going on here? Every time I turn my back, we've got triangle bandits attacking. The tech hunters are out there. Um, everyone, just come help. Might as well. Again, I need the combat experience. And I don't want my tech hunters ruined. Murder face is down. Massive head injury. Damn. Quick! Medic! Everyone's like, nah. Or maybe he was already patched up. Go ahead and... Don't dismantle that, please. Go ahead and pick up Murder Face. Lifting, snatching order. So, we're basically at the point where I can just leave my gate open as we flop Murder Face down on the inside. Uh, the mercenaries will take care of it. I think my dinosaurs and the rest of my team would be able to take care of it, too. The biggest danger, of course, is when somebody comes up here to attack and ends up just fighting solo. Like, what are you doing, Dino? Staying close to Mind's Eye? I mean, Mind's Eye is right there. This is... The, the pathing is obviously telling the dinosaur that it has to go here if it wants to get close. But could you not? Maybe I just need to have you guys follow no one? Do your own damn thing. Pretty sure I've tried that, too. And then they just want to wander all over the damn place. Inside, outside. Doesn't even matter. Slacks, what's your armor crafting up to? 13. Plump's at 33. I doubt we have anyone better. And you know what? I need to do something here. So, I, I hate doing this because it, it becomes much harder to keep track of all your units, but I need to add a squad. This is going to be... base labor for now. Uh, the question is, I guess I just drag and drop. Mind's eye... Bruno, Corbin, all of the new blood, you're going down here. Branching off into your own little squad. I'm going to give you Interceptor and Murder Face. And Denver, and we'll split that up. I guess I can rearrange this? Cool. 40 hours into a playlist, roughly, and I just figured out some more basics. I approve of that. I want my bug men together. Get everybody lined up. This is a pretty badass warrior squad. Okay. My AI settings are good. Follow formation. Military caravan. Formation used when squad leaders. Yeah, just pick and choose. I don't really care. Uh, the unfortunate thing is now I have to switch between the squads in order to check their status. So... It can become a little bit frustrating. I, I'm going to assume that these bars will flash if somebody in a group is under attack. Yep, it'll flash blood red. That's, n it, that's not a good enough sign for me, honestly. <laughs> this is where people start dying. I can almost guarantee it. Okay. 
Yum. Base labor, I'm also going to make all of you automatics. You're already doing it. This will be good for your skills, obviously. Someday you guys might start operating as your own group. And in that case... You will need to be able to heal each other. And at some point, they'll I'll upgrade their name too. They're not going to be base labor forever. Maybe for another 20, 30, 40 videos. But we'll see. I've got... Basically like 160 iron plates. Damn. That's really good. What do I do with all of this stuff, folks? I'm not just building to build things yet. I'll say, why haven't you guys went and used your copper yet? Oh, because I don't have you set up to engineer. There we go. Ira. You never had any. You're a search and rescue guy. See, it doubled this stuff up. I have not done that. It's automatically doubling it up. I think every time I import, it copies it. You're an engineer. Pretty much everyone else should be an engineer. Make you a medic. Always medic first, I guess. I don't really need that extra power. I haven't even seen my batteries run out once yet. Hey, buying some shades? Hell yeah, this guy put them on. Quink of the Tech Hunters. I like your style, man. He's like, no, I like your style, bro. I'm gonna send all of my Tech Hunter friends here. For Slaxer branded Wasteland Shades. go now I can add more spotlights if I want to 150 power it doesn't look like that it didn't look like that really increased my power out input I wonder if there's a limit on uh, how much power generation you can pack into one small area or it probably did increase but I just wasn't looking so the video knows. The video always knows. I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Um, whenever we come back... I might actually take some of these people on a small journey. Kyra, Revy, Slax, and Kang... four-man squad I can't go into the Deadlands I, we I didn't find anything in Shim except the Smuggler's Bar which might be worth checking out if I wanted to look into hiring even more people which I kind of do but I think what I'll, what I'll do is I'll take those four up to the Ominous Ruins and the Destroyed House and if there's nothing there Maybe we'll dive into the Deadlands for a moment. Check out the ruins. Uh, if I could make it to Black Desert City, I do know that it has buildings we could hide inside. And avoid the acid rain. But... We'll deal with that next time. I'll see y'all then.